everybody. I'm Lisa. Behind the camera is Bill. Together we are Belisa. Welcome to our channel. Let's try that a little bit slower. I have been to 24 stores to buy bathing suits just for you to do bathing suit hauls and I'm going to list each one off for you. Are you ready? We have Pretty Little Thing, Target, Walmart, Kohl's, Macy's, H&M, TJ Maxx, Tilly's, PacSun, Fox Racing, Volcom, Quicksilver, Hurley, Hollister, Zoomies, Aeropostale, Marshalls, Forever 21, JCPenney, Old Navy, Ross, Nordstrom Rack, Burlington, Dee Dee's Discounts. Whew, I'm exhausted. But now I'm going to show you my seven favorite bathing suits of the season. Let's get started. Number one is this gorgeous two-piece from Walmart. I chose this bathing suit for a number of reasons. First of all, high-waisted bathing suit bottoms trending this year. Second of all, belted bathing suits trending this year. And third of all, animal print trending this year, making this one of the trendiest bathing suits I tried on all season. As far as the high-waisted bottoms are concerned, these were my favorite of all of the high-waisted bottoms I tried on. And if you watched all or even most of my videos, you know there were a lot of them. This right here is adjustable. The straps as well are adjustable. The bottom belt actually even works, which makes it adjustable as well. So these bottoms fit me perfectly, and I love the pink highlights. Number two is this classy one piece from TJ Maxx. If you guys watched the video and you recall, this amazing Michael Kors designer one piece was an amazing high quality bathing suit without the high price, which I was thrilled about. That's not one of the number one reasons this made it on my list of top seven bathing suits. But the other reason is the fit. Look how nicely this bathing suit fits and this cut with this cutout right here on the side makes everything fit and stay in place just perfectly. I also love that the cut of this bathing suit is so unique. Having only one shoulder strap, this shoulder strap totally, or this shoulder totally open, a hole right here, it is just so classy, so stylish, and completely unique with a name brand. Number three is this black two-piece from Pretty Little Thing. We went from classy one-piece to super sexy two-piece. This bathing suit has some great features. The first thing I love about it is the vinyl fabric. When I'm stepping out of the water and the water is dripping off of it, I love the way that looks. I also really enjoy the high cut legs and the way I feel it accentuates the length of my legs. Check out the cut of the bottoms. They are so nice and thin and such a nice little cut for this bathing suit, making it sleek and sexy. The top has two adjustable points so that I can make it fit me absolutely perfect. And those are the reasons that this made it on my list of the top seven bathing suits this season. Number four on the list is this hot pink two-piece from Ross. This bathing suit color with the neon pink is spectacular. I think if I wear this to the beach or a pool, I will stand out in a crowd because of the color. I also like the high neck. I tried on a few bathing suits this season with a high neck and a halter tie. This was absolutely my favorite. But the number one thing about this bathing suit that I love is this crisscross that goes right down the middle, giving just a little bit of show off of the skin. And it coordinates so perfectly with the bottoms. The bottoms fit really, really nicely. They're just a standard bikini bottom and I feel very comfortable wearing this bathing suit. Number five on the list is this black and white two-piece from Zoomies. 
This bathing suit has such a classic look with the black background and the tiny white polka dots, and it's such a simple cut. It's just a simple triangle top with standard bikini bottoms, but one of the things that I love about it is that it is a full coverage triangle top. I feel really comfortable when I wear this bathing suit. The bottoms as well are a nice full coverage standard bikini bottom with a nice comfortable fit. This bathing suit, while it is so simple and standard, I really like the idea that the black with the white polka dots is just such a classy look. And the other thing about this one is the ties around the neck are nice thick ties, making this bathing suit top feel perfectly secure. Number six on the list is this luxurious one piece from Pretty Little Thing. This fabric reminds me of Versace fabric, which is one of the things I love about it. The other thing I love is the belt, and this belt is fully adjustable. You can tie it to fit you just perfectly. The other option is to completely remove it all together and have a separate look if you don't want to wear the belt at all. It has a nice tight halter top around the neck and it has two straps on each side that ties, giving it a nice look with all of these straps here. This has a nice high cut leg and I love the way it fits. It fits so nice right here in the V-neck area. Everything just feels perfectly secure. And number seven is this snakeskin one piece from Pretty Little Thing. The things that I love about this bathing suit, first of all, the snakeskin fabric is really, really cool. This bathing suit was purchased and one of the number one reasons I bought bathing suits from Pretty Little Thing was because they had floss bathing suits, which sometimes can be misconstrued as to what that means. But what it means is it has these flossy pieces that wrap all the way around the middle and have multiple ways that they can be worn. This bathing suit can be tied in the front, tied in the back, in the middle, on the side, whatever way you like. I love this cutout right here in the front in the middle. And the back is so nice as well. It has this nice low scoop neck, but otherwise it's a pretty full coverage back. The straps that go around give it a really nice and unique look. And that is why I picked this bathing suit to be number seven on my list. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and enjoyed seeing which bathing suits I liked best from the 2020 season. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe. Bye!